Oh, what is up guys? It is me, Sarge Pianta here. Uh, this is a video that I've been holding off for a while. But now that I finally got my top loader binder of Pokemon cards. Now that I finally got that uh, all situated, put all the cards in there that I wanted to. We are going to, I'm going to show you guys what I got, man. I've been collecting Pokemon for a minute now. I started back in um, January of this past year. And I've managed to open so many packs, get a lot of good pulls. And um, I've put cards in here from those pulls and also from my old binder that I've had since I was younger. So this is filled with some nice stuff, some more vintage stuff as well, um, but a lot of modern great cards. So, you know, I'm excited to do it. So let's get into it. All right, guys, so here we go. So this is a fun guys binder. Um, it's very good quality and it was like 40 bucks or something, maybe like 42 bucks with tags. Um, so if you have a lot of cards that, in top loaders and you want to put them somewhere, this is a definitely a great binder. So let's just jump right into the first page. So right here we get this Iron Moth coming in from New Paradox Rift. This is the GameStop promo that you get. Here's a Charmander promo from 151 that you get as well. Uh, and then we have a Charizard EX. You know, in the beginning, by the way, these are just some, you know, pretty, um, not that uh, more rare cards. These are kind of just some nicer hits that I like and that, you know, go for a couple bucks. So here's the Iron Hands from Paradox Rift. Goes for, you know, I don't know, <laughs> decent price. Here's a cool Terra Gyarados from Scarlet and Violet. We got the new Roaring Moon EX, pretty sick card. We have the Mew EX from 151, awesome card. And then we got the Rapid Strike, oh, sorry, this is a Single Strike, actually. Single Strike Urshifu, and then we got the Rayquaza. This is a dope card, I'm surprised it doesn't go for more, just because Rayquaza is so hyped up. Uh, now we have an Umbreon VMAX. We got a um, Shadow Rider Calyrex VMAX. We got a Flareon VMAX. Here we have one of the Secret Rare Energies from Crown Zenith. Uh, it's very dope. Pikachu promo. We got the Reggie Oleki VMAX. And then here's some older reverse rares. These are all, by the way, these cards are all mint condition. Um, near mint to gem mint. We got the Weavile G, reverse rare. Crawdon G, reverse rare. These are awesome, man. I love when they used to do these trainer cards back in the Demna Pro Platinum era. And then we have the Electivire FB, really sick. Here's just an old school Metagross reverse. Um, I'm not sure what set this is from. Pretty sure it might be uh, a Diamond and Pearl set. Then right here we have a Miss Magius Reverse Rare. This is from uh, a Heart Gold, so Silver Set, I'm not sure which one. And then this is the Umbreon promo from the Evolving Skies, three pack blister. And over here we have an old school Lieutenant Surge, Japanese Raiju. Um, managed to get this card somehow. Uh, I don't really know how, but it's pretty dope. Um, you know, it's in pretty good condition. There's a, as you can see on the edges, just a little bit of wear. I mean, it's an old ass card and it wasn't mine. You know, if it was mine, I would have kept it in better condition, but. Yeah, so here we have a G, uh, Jirachi. This is a reverse rare from EX Deoxys, really sick. And then, you know, these are just a couple of the glaring gal gallery cards. Um, I'm not big on these, to be honest with you. I have a lot more of these that I didn't even put in the binder, but this is one of the promos from the Crown Zenith 10. Lapras with the baby Lapras, really nice artwork. We got the Riolu, a Caldeo. And on the next page, we got uh, some more stuff. We got a Deoxys. We got the Magmordar, we got the Mareep, and then I like this little section I made right here, this little Pikachu section. We have the Secret Pikachu from Crown Zenith. This is the Pikachu Gallery from Cosmic Eclipse. Actually a pretty valuable card, all things considered. And then this is just a Pikachu from Crown Zenith. And then the Zekrom right here, I love his artwork with N. And then this is the um, Elite Trainer Box Crown Zenith promo of Lucario. We get the Charizard V-Star from Crown Zenith. So really nice looking card. And then um, right here is when, I think this is when we start to get into some cooler some cooler stuff. Um, we have the Mega Tyranitar EX, just a regular artwork, no full or nothing. Really sick. Here we have a Luxury Level X from Celebrations. Hello GX, pretty sure this is from uh, Burning Shadows, if I'm not mistaken. And then uh, here's a Mewtwo EX from um, XY Evolution. Mega Mewtwo EX, really sick one right there. Mega Altaria, so you know, we got a couple XY Megas. Then we got the Mega Sizor, and then here we got two old EXs. We got the Blaziken EX, um, really sick card, man, mint condition as well. And the Sceptile EX, Delta Species of Psychic type, which is really dope. And then here we got, uh, this is a dope page. Look at this, man. We got some nice old school level Xs. We got a Lucario level X right there, really sick. We got the Charizard G level X promo. This is such a fire card. And these are all mint condition, like I said. Um, tried to keep these as good as I could. We got the Regigigas level X right there. We got the Gallade from the Elite Four level X. Azelf level X, Arceus level X. This one is so sick because it got these little, little swirl pattern right in the middle, really cool. We got the Electivire FB level X, the Garchomp, Cynthia's Garchomp level X, really sick. 
and they need dark brown and black. So this one might be a little bit in condition. I think this was a promo, right? Uh, yeah, as you can see, right there, Black Star promo. So that's a promo. But, you know, sick regardless. And then we get the Absol G Level X. This one I remember being really high pulling that when I was. When I was a kid. Now here we got some just some rainbows. Uh, we got the schoolboy rainbow. We get the chili and silent and crest. We get the zizu. Some of these names are fucking crazy. Like zizu, <laughs> chili. Oh, come on. Uh, Leon. We get the Galarian Darmanitan V Max. Kyron V Max. Trevenant V Max from Above the Skies. We get the RCSV star. Not one, but we got two RCSV stars. And of course the very very nice. Charizard, Rainbow, from Brilliant Stars, sick. Now here we're gonna get into just a couple gold cards that I've got. Uh, this is actually the solid gold Mew EX from the uh, 151 Ultra Premium Collection. This is not the standard one that you get in the set. And then here we have two Ultra Balls. Uh, one of these from Brilliant Stars. I think this is the Brilliant Stars one, and this one is from, oh God, I'm not sure. I forgot what set these are from. Uh, yeah, but uh, one of these is from Billion Stars, I'm almost positive. I might be wrong, I'm not sure. And then we have the um, basic lightning energy, and this one is really cool, man. I'm a fan of this one, the superior energy retrieval. This is from, uh, I believe it's Pal Day Evolved in the Beach Court from Paradox Rift, Train Court. Uh, I think it's from Fusion Strike. We get the Artisan, and then we get two of the Iron Valiants from the new Paradox Rift. Sick. And then we also have the Crydon EX from Scarlet and Violet Base. And then this is dope, man. The Gyarados EX. I believe it's from Breakpoint, XY Breakpoint. This one's really good mint condition as well. Um, yeah, I wish they still did go cards like these, but you know, sadly, we just got you know, <laughs> regular, regular stuff like that. And now we are going to hop into, these are a bunch of uh, just illustration rares from, you know, more modern sets. So we got Slowpoke, we got the Starly, we got King Gambit, and we got the Clauncher. I love this artwork, by the way, in this Clauncher. Uh, really cool. I think I actually have a few of those. Uh, and then we have the Wiglet, also really cool artwork. We have two of these Tyranitars. We're going to pull two of those. Uh, Pyro, this is sick, man. This reminds me of, like, Lion King. <laughs> you know, it's like Simba looking off into the into the Amazon. Fucking dope. Uh, we got Grafii. We got Paldan Tours. Uh, cool artwork. And then right here, we got some sick ones. We got Fletchinder. We got the Pseudo Udo. This one is so cool, man. Something about it. It's like really subtle. And then the Mouse Hold. Really dope. That guy's got a little mushroom in his head. He's probably ripped. And then Gloom. Gloom is tweaking out right now in a in his own little world. <laughs> we got Sizor. We got Lechonk. We got Varum. This is cool. And then these are, we got some 151 art rares. Um, we got the Mewtwo from the Ultra Premium Collection. We got the Pikachu. Really dope. Uh, Ammonite, love this artwork on the Ammonite, by the way. It really gives it that, uh, that ancient feel. And then we got the Dragonair, the Nido King, some sick ones. And then we have uh, Psyduck right there, Snorlax, we got Charmeleon, the Machoke, love that one. And then we got two of these Joltics. Now, uh, these are some Paradox Rift ones that we got. We got two Toad School as well. We got an Age Slash, uh, Veluza, we got an Espathra, pretty dope, Plusle. Swablu, Yen Xiao, cool. And now we are gonna hop into uh, some full arts. These are a couple of full arts from, um, from Sword and Shield, and then I have a lot more from just, uh, you know, Scarlet and Violet. And I do have, I have so many more full arts in my old XY binder, but I just I just didn't want to take them out of there to put them in here. It doesn't make sense to switch the binder. But I'll show that off one day in another video. So we got Chandelure V right there. We got Leafeon, we got Golurk. We got Sharon's Care. This is a cool card. I, I always love the trainer for Lords. We have a Noivern V it's from Evolving Skies. Boss's Orders. Lysander from uh, Lost Origin. We got the Volo right there. Lunala GX. We got a GX. There we go. I didn't really collect them Sun and Moon, so that's why I really have like, no Sun and Moon cards. Um, I just got Lucky pulling it in like a pack. <laughs> and we got Boss's Orders and the Clara. These are both from the uh, this little milk, the milk carton uh, promo cards. Let me get the Giovanni's Exile, really sick. This is a dope one, Brock's great. I love this one from Evolutions because they've made him feel like, you know, still like one of the old school, like a reprint rather than like the new style that they got here. So this one's sick. And then these are a couple XY ones, actually. We get Genesect, uh, the Dark Rye EX. And then this one's one of my favorites, man. The Charizard EX from Flashfire. Super valuable card as well. This is damn near mint condition. Couldn't even be a 10 if I got it graded. Uh, Waylord right here. And then these are awesome, man. I love the Mega Evolutions, bro. Mega Tyranitar EX. We got the Mega Houndoom EX. Mega Pidgeot EX. Really sick, man. 
and then you mega steel it, so this is cool. And this is, I believe, where we hop into uh, some Scarlet and Violet stuff. So we got Miriam, and we got Arvin, and then what do we got here? We got Great Tusk EX, sick. We got the Gyarados Tower, awesome, one of my favorite ones. Uh, Gardevoir EX, Oink Loin EX, Lavelle, Dangerous, you know, yeah, these are just some standard full arch, you know, nothing too crazy, but the next, uh, the next section is where it, it's gonna get really cool. We got the Ting Lu, the Slow King, the Dene. We got the Noivern EX. I love this Noivern full art way more than this one from Evolving Skies. Me personally, this one is okay, but this one is just sick in my opinion. Um, they really upped their game up on the artwork and the full arts in my opinion. And then we get the Cloud Sire, Annihilate. We got two of these Terra Charizards, really cool. We get the Rhyme, the Gita, whatever. Yeah, I mean, you know, who gives a shit about these, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, and then here we got some uh, sick ones. We get some 151s. We get a Jinx. We get Alakazam. We get Arbok. I actually really like this Arbok. Um, really cool. We get the Wigglytuff, the Golem, and the Mew. Mew is obviously a fucking hype one. And then we got Daisy's help. And now here we jump into some Paradox Rift. Just a couple ones. We got two Melons, which are really cool, man. This artwork is so sick. It could have almost be an SIR, the way it's the way it's like printed. It's like very cartoon-like. Uh, so yeah, that's sick. And then we got Professor Sadis Vitality, Professor Tauros Scenario, Mousehold EX, Goldango EX, Aegis Slash, and this one, I don't know why it's here actually, but we have, oh, what is that right there? You see that? That's, I probably just got in. Um, let me actually get that out, because that's gonna bug me. So yeah, we got the Primal Kyogre EX. Really sick. Where is it? Yeah, see, it was just on the, something I got in there. But yeah, man, I mean, this card is fucking dope. This is one of my favorites as well. So yeah, really sick on that. Is that a rip? Oh, no, it's just a little crease. Okay, so now we are going to get into some... These are just a couple gallery, like, you know, if you want to call them alternate arts. And then we are going to get into actual alt arts from Sword and Shield. We're going to get into a lot of SARs. So, you know, this is where some, some stuff comes into play, some very nice stuff. So we got the Melanie right here. Crown Zenith, we got the Grant from Crown Zenith, we got the Roxanne from Crown Zenith, and here we go, we got the Mewtwo V-Star from Crown Zenith, awesome, Simiseer V-Star, that one's okay, you know, I'm not the biggest fan on that, to be honest with you, just kind of goofy looking, Darkrai, this one's so cool, because this is just, um, it. it's just a complete remaster of him in the game, when you find him in Diamond and Pearl and Platinum, it's like the same area that he's in, so it's really cool, Retro Gigas, I love this one as well, we got the Mewtwo and Mew tag team promo. This one is fucking so sick. You know, it's and it's textured as well. It's really cool. We get the Honcho V from oh, Honcho, sorry, from uh, Brilliant Stars. We get the Jolteon V. This was the promo from the uh, those collection boxes. Then we have the Sweet Coon from Crown Zenith. We got the Raikou from Crown Zenith as well. I love that one. And then here's where we get into some crazy shit. We get the Umbreon V from Evolving Skies. We get the Lugia V from Silver Tempest. Man, this card is. I actually I shit my pants when I pulled down. And then Giratina V, Alt Art. This one is one of my favorites. It'll always be one of my favorites just because this card specifically, because how I pulled it. Uh, local game store near, I'm sorry, a local comic store actually near me. They have a big Pokemon day every year and they had Lost Origin Booster Box for $100. And I bought one thinking, you know, maybe I'll get lucky and I actually fucking got the Giratina V. Odds of that are so unlikely because Alt Arts are pretty tough to pull, especially in like sets like that, so. Yeah, and then we get the Vaporeon VMAX promo, and then, of course, brother, come on, look at this. We got the fucking Moonbreon from Evolving Skies, man, mint condition, so sick, a little off-centered, but oh my god, I mean, this is the card that you're gonna want in your collection, bro, this is it, fucking awesome. And then we get the Jolteon VMAX uh, promo as well. We had the Raladon V, which uh, I pulled that one, and, you know, it could have been... Could have been the Rayquaza, could have been the Sylveon, but of course it was the least expensive one of the set. <laughs> Just my luck. And then uh, here's where we get into um, some of the SIRs from Scarred and Violet. We got the Guard of War EX, we got the Maridon EX. These are awesome, man. I love the SIRs, I really do. And the Miriam, can't go wrong with that. We got the Grusher right there, the Giacomo, really cool. We got the Chiyu, I love this one, man. It's like he's swimming in like a fucking fire pit of water, is what it looks like. <laughs> We got the Quack of All EX. This one's okay. Uh, the Gita, or the Gita, whatever it is. That one's so dope. And then we have the Ice Q. You know, not much going on with the card, but it's okay. The Charizard, of course. 
Come on, I have to forget the Charizard from the Steam Flames, man. That one is fucking fire. Can't go wrong with the Charizard. You know, you really can't. And the Pidgeot, I really like this one. This one's cool, just because the other, um, the Pidgey and the Pidgeotto aren't rares that go along with this card. It's like a story leading up to it, so it's really dope. And here we have a lot of the 151 stuff. We have uh, Giovanni's Charisma, Erica's Invitation. We get the Mew X promo. I, I love this, uh, these two, man. These are two really good pick. You know what would have made this set, though? Like, obviously, it's one of the best sets that we've had in a minute, but if they had, like, a couple more trainers, like, if we had, like, Sabrina, or, like, imagine a Lieutenant, uh, Lieutenant Surge SIR or a Blaine SIR. Like, dude, that just would've been so cool. It would've just made it even better. <laughs> we have an Alakazam right here, really fire. We get the, these two, man, oh my God. I think these are better than the Charizard, in my opinion, in hand. I mean, we get the Blastoise, which is so fucking cool. And then we get the Venusaur. This artwork is ridiculous. This is probably one of my favorite cards in this binder, to be honest with you. Really cool. And then we have the Zapdos right here. So I actually have all seven of the SRs except for the Charizard. Pulled all these and didn't pull the Charizard from 151. I have all, well, I guess if you don't want to count the Mew. So we have six from the set, and then the seventh one would be the Charizard. So it's the only one I don't have. So I'll probably, you know, I'll probably just buy that because I, I don't want to really rip more packs just to try to pull one card. And then we are just about done here. We actually have three more cards left. These are from Paradox Rift. We get the Parasol Lady, Iron Hands, and finally we got the Tapu Coco EX SIR. So, uh, yeah, guys, I mean, that is it. That's it for this binder, man. Um, this is kind of what I've been trying to accumulate for the past, you know, couple months or so. So, you know, I'm happy that we finally got this all situated. And, uh, yeah, man, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Peace out.